friends in this video i'm going to tell you how to install eclipse on windows uh, 10 or 11 so first of all you have to search for uh, eclipse so the first link will be open here just go to this link and click on download so now you just need to click on this link to download this the 80 64 bit uh, xe file just click on it to download. XE file will be downloaded. You just need to open it to install. And we'll see how can we run our first Java code on Eclipse. Just click on uh, download. And our file will be started downloading. So it is of uh, 1 to 122 MB. Once the file are downloaded, you just need to open it to install. But before that, you have to make sure that you have installed the Java. If you don't know how to install Java, so you can watch my latest video on that. And uh, also to uh, set up the environment variable, uh, I'll explain everything in that video. So first of all, uh, you, have, uh, you have to choose uh, why you need uh, Eclipse installer. So, you just need to click on this first Eclipse IDE for the Java developer. So if you want this uh, Eclipse for the Java Java developer, you just click on it. And now you can uh, choose the JDK. So since I have already installed uh, the JDK, you just need to select from here and just click on to install. Now we need to uh, accept, accept the terms and condition. So if you want to download or install the JDK, you just need to uh, type Java JDK download and uh, and click on the first link. And uh, now you have to go to Windows and click on the sec second link to download its uh, downloader, the uh, installer. So once it is uh, is file is downloaded, you just need to open it to install. And once it is installed. Then you have to uh, set up the environment variable. So let me see the installation is done or not. So to do to do uh, that the environment variable, what you need to do, you have to uh, search for edit. Or uh, you edit the system variables. Just click on it. Click on environment variables. Now in the path, which basically you just need to click on this edit option, and in the in this envi edit environment variable, click on new and the paste the path uh, paste the path of bin folder in JDK. So you can go to uh, basically the C drive where the JDK is installed. So first of all, you have to install JDK before uh, doing this process. Make sure you have installed it in, and it is a very straightforward process. Once you install, click on bin and choose the path or copy the path here and just paste it paste it here by clicking on new and just paste it since i have already paste uh, added here so i can click on cancel but you have to click on okay after adding the path fine so now in the very user variable you just need to click on new and, and just type java home underscore home Fine and enter the variable values. So in va uh, variable value, what you need to do? You have to go back to the installer folder and come out of the bin folder and just copy the path of the JDK folder. And now you just need to paste it here. 
just click on okay to add so i'm gonna cancel because i i have already added the path here with java home variable once you're done just click on okay and click on okay to verify if your java jdk is installed or not you just need to open the command prompt and just type this uh, command java hyphen hyphen and version enter and your java jdk detail will be shown on your screen so just close this window now it's time to install our uh, eclipse so it is taking a while so let's wait for a moment to install it it's almost done so it will automatically install uh, uh basically select the jdk folder and you just need to click on launch to so launch eclipse and we are going to see how can we run our first eclipse uh, first our uh, first uh, java code on eclipse so let's click on launch to launch it now once it is open guys just click on file and click on new and click on a java project you can also create a maven project from here now just name your just name your project here so i'm gonna name it as first and uh, what can i do just click on next so and just click on finish So once you have created your uh, uh, the project, now click on the project expanded expanded source folder. In source folder, in source folder, you have to create a Java class or uh, yeah Java class and enter the name of the class like uh, first example. and you can enter the package as well so i'm gonna name it as com dot java dot tutorial and uh, you can also uh you can also the match uh choose the method you want to create like i'm gonna add it here the main class main method and just click on finish to so it will uh, create this Java first class, first example class with main method automatically. Fine. So if you want to run your first, uh, if you want to run uh, Java code, you, you can print any statement here. So I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna print here. Sys no system dot out dot print ln and i'm gonna uh, print hello world so let's guys run this code to run this you need just need to click on this uh, run button and the output will be here so hello world understood so that's how you can run your first hello world program and eclipse Hope you like it. Hope you understood. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.